working with the leadership of the NATO Parliamentary Assembly, they have selected Dayton uh, to come for their spring meeting in May of 2025. A new Center 7 exclusive. We have learned Dayton has been chosen to host an event that will bring in hundreds of leaders from all over the world. Good afternoon. I'm Cheryl McHenry. And I'm Gabrielle Enright. James Brown is on special assignment. Dayton Congressman Mike Turner, as you heard, confirmed to us today that Dayton will host the spring session of the NATO Parliamentary Assembly in May of next year. I sat down with Congressman Turner today and I asked him, why Dayton? Congressman Mike Turner serves as head of the U.S. delegation to NATO's Parliamentary Assembly. The group wanted to do something to celebrate the 30th anniversary of the Dayton Peace Accords, which ended the Bosnian War in 1995. I suggested that they come here. They agreed. We expect uh, that about 650 people from just over 50 countries will come here. And uh, with that, we'll have uh, the Secretary General of NATO. 650 people from NATO and partner countries that meet to discuss the important issues that NATO itself is discussing. The parliamentarians work to pass resolutions to try to effect and change policy. For example, we just had a meeting and the major topic there was changing the restraints on Ukraine so that they can use the weapons they've been provided to attack inside Russia to defend themselves. Turner says he has secured some federal funding as well as money from the NATO Parliamentary Assembly itself. But instead of holding this event on base, like the Bosnian Peace Accords, the focus of this huge gathering will be downtown Dayton. Well, this event will celebrate the role that Dayton has in really international events. With Wright-Patterson Air Force Base, so much of our national security travels through Wright-Patterson Air Force Base and occurs within the fence there, just as the Dayton Peace Accord negotiations when we had all the world leaders descend upon Dayton. And Gabby, Congressman Turner says uh, this is expected to take place around the Memorial Day weekend next year, 2025. This is a big deal. I mean, it, very exciting for this community. It really is, you know, and, and he, Turner, you know, he used to be mayor of Dayton in the mm -hmm. 90s. He says he's very proud to show off his hometown to his friends and his professional colleagues from the NATO Parliamentary Assembly. Glad we'll to have them here. It'll wait and see how this all plays out. We will. This would be the first time the U.S. has hosted a spring session of the Assembly in two decades. Here's how Dayton 2025 came to be. Discussions between Turner and NATO began in May of 2022. This past January, Turner brought the NATO conference staff to Dayton and they spent days visiting possible venues and discussing logistics like hotels and security. And then in March, Turner made the official announcement in Estonia that Dayton would host the 2025 spring session. Turner will make a public announcement alongside Governor DeWine and Dayton Mayor Jeff Mims on Monday.